Professor, you were talking about how Legionnaire's disease may be spreading around the Sydney CBD at the moment. Can you provide some insight on, on what's going on? Sure. Uh, the germ Legionella likes to be in water and it likes cooling towers in big buildings. So people have been exposed to big buildings, air conditioning, the germ goes into the mist and then it goes into their lungs. It doesn't spread from person to person. The dose is very little between people, but the dose of the germ is highest in people exposed to the air conditioning in big buildings in the centre of the city. Well, there's nothing you can do about air conditioning in, in buildings, is there? I mean, it's on no matter what. Well, yes, but the, the thing that they should be doing is checking at least monthly in the cooling tower for the germ. And that's normal procedure. And maybe uh, one building, they, they miss their check. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but it's something that's normally protected against by monthly tests of the water in the cooling towers in every big building in the city. All right. Well, that's a call out there. The, the symptoms are very similar to COVID, aren't they? And it can lead to yes. things like pneumonia. Oh, absolutely. It is similar to COVID. You can get a, 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 a cough, a shortness of breath, a high fever, a headache. Um, and um, so it's like COVID that, but it doesn't spread between people with respiratory root. And that's the difference. There isn't a vaccine for it either. So uh, what you have to do is recognise it early, see a GP and get antibiotic treatment because pneumonia, uh, the pneumonia that can occur can be quite severe, especially if you're an older person, you're a cigarette smoker or you've got chronic lung disease. OK, antibiotics. All right, that's the key. Thanks, um, Professor. We'll talk to you again soon. Have a great day. You too. Thank you.